And a tough start to this Tuesday. We go now to our other top story, another senseless shooting in Detroit, this time with two innocent victims, a two-year-old girl and a man who was hit by a bullet down the street. Shots fired this morning at the corner of Witt and Lawndale in southwest Detroit. Officers now searching for the getaway car and at least one person who was inside firing the shots. 7 Action News reporter Jim Kurtzner just spoke with the man who was hit by a bullet. And Jim, how's he doing? Glenn and Brian, he's okay, but let me show you how far the stray bullet had to travel. This is the corner where the shooting happened and then come around all the way down the street past several of these vehicles. That's where Calvin Wynn was working on his vehicle, under his vehicle, when he was hit. I was out here working on my car and I heard some gunshots, so I happened to look down that way and I seen him coming this way and they kept shooting, so I leaned in toward the car there and I heard it hit the concrete and then I felt like a hit, like hit me like lightning. Calvin was working under this car in front of his house. His mother was inside and says she heard a muffled gunshot. We come downstairs. <laughs> he goes, Mom, I got a shot. And he show me the back. Turns out Calvin had work on his back and a brace under his skin, causing the bullet to enter, hit that brace, and exit. Uh, I'm in pain, I'll tell you that. But I'm doing okay. You're lucky. Thanking God, yeah, I'm thanking God because some I got three passed away sons, and one of all three of them must have been my angels. A block down is where at least six shots were fired from one car into another. Police say it's a big gun, a nine millimeter. The only one hit in the targeted car, the two-year-old girl, silver or gray Jeep with the shooter or shooters got away. Police are looking at surveillance videos from this nearby business and from ring doorbells from homes on Wit, including one right across the street from where Calvin was shot. This is insane because this street, we've been on here for 50 years and never, never have we had an incident like this. I think some don't care, obviously, if you're willing to fire, fire a bunch of rounds in the middle of a neighborhood at 9 o'clock in the morning, uh, you don't care who's out there or who gets hurt. What would you say to the guys who pulled the trigger down the street? I say you're, you're worthless punks, man. You can't get out and fight somebody. You got to shoot somebody. Mm -hmm. Now, Detroit police may be releasing images from that surveillance video if they need help solving this case. That two-year-old girl this afternoon still in serious condition. Live in southwest Detroit, Jim Kurtzner, 7 Action News. Glad to see that he's doing okay. Jim, thank you.